Okay, this is a, the hoof that I'm going to make a replica of. Um, first thing I want you to notice is you can see where it's tried to self-trim. And you can actually see horn tubules here. See the little hairs? And step, so this has been soaking for three days. This horse uh, wasn't trimmed over five times in his life. He was about eight or nine years old when he was put down due to blindness. Um, and so this is an example of what horses' hooves would be like in Kansas. You know, um, they don't, in wet weather, they don't trim real good. Uh, heels are run forward, but really he's got a pretty good foot considering he never got trimmed or really got any hoof care. Now I've had this soaking for three days. I haven't got the hoof capsule off, but what I'm going to show you is how I'll be able to just pull this hoof capsule off. And see, this, uh, you, you need to understand this because see, when your lamina is damaged, the sole is damaged. Um, the horse can actually walk right out of the hoof capsule very slowly. What happens is the internal foot comes up and then all this wall here will grow down to meet it. And uh, so anyway, so I'm going to take this off, I think. There we go. Okay, now, there you go. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. The internal foot. Now, I just pulled that off. So you can imagine when it got laminitis, what happens. Right? There we go. Flies are bad. Alright. Get some good pictures of it there. go and here we go all right okay thanks Neil